Hello YouTube. Um, here is a quick video about creating uh, graphs from certain data. Um, in another way, it's the visual representation of the data. Um, here are the four types of graphs that we're going to be drawing today: line graphs, bar graph, pie chart, and scatter graph. Line graph, which is um, if the data were um, uh, spaced in certain intervals um, in time as you can see here is the inflation rate um, during a year uh, month by month uh, you choose your data you go to insert and here is the gra the charts that you can use we're gonna use the line and we're gonna use this one the simple line not um, the stacked or the 100% stacked line <clears throat> and here is um, the graph now from the chart tool that you can change the editing and the format of this graph uh, either by changing the colors or by changing the shape of the graph here which is the orientation of the, uh, the number of the series uh, the series or even uh, the distribution whether you want uh, vertical lines or horizontal lines and so on and you can do that by choosing the graph uh, the option from here directly you can also change the layout which is the axis uh, the guide uh, guidelines and so on from here and then the format which is uh, changing the text the naming and so on the second graph which is the bar chart that's when the data are can be um, categorized into fewer um, options or categories um, you choose both the category and the number and then you go again to insert charts bar now uh, the from this list only these uh, the horizontal bar exist now if you want the vertical bars we click on to all charts and we choose the column now we can choose the column directly from here obviously um, and here is the bar chart or obviously as the name in here as a column and again the same as the the, old, the chart before uh, from the chart tool you can change the design and here you can change the shape of the layout and here also the layout regarding axis and guide lines and then the format of the text now the third is the pie chart you choose the category and you choose the repeat repetition of every category and then you go insert pie pie chart and here we'll calculate the percentage um, of the of every option that you have and again you, if you want to add the percentage um, you just have to change again from the chart tool change the layout the scatter graph is the same here we have two examples uh, one which is uh, the relation uh, scatter uh, graph between the weight and the height and insert scatter and without a line only marks and here is the scatter graph you can see that there is an orientation for the scatter graph which is an indication that there is a relationship between um, the height and the weight which is we're gonna see how we're gonna calculate this relationship later on when we talk about the numerical representation of the data and uh, for uh, the second example which is the height and the lucky number and then we choose insert scatter graph as you can see that the, this graph um, which is the relationship between the height and the lucky number is scattered which is mean that there is no relationship between them which is we're gonna find again numerically how we can represent that thanks for watching